Now, we just gotta move. So let's see what we got. I've got you, babe, Meteor. But wait a minute, are you a sage or you're, ooh. Ow. That's a level 20 sage. You're too kind to me. Casting Meteor, which is a, a ranged ability. Do you have... No, and you're carrying money. Thirty not no wait, thirty resistance, right? Where are all these lost items I'm finding? What is this? Can you imagine even with the dragon transformation and everything? The main character still doesn't have the resistance that she does. I don't think you two are going to get there anytime soon. No, you're going to, yeah. <laughs> Down! Okay, hold on. Roy's moving. Tell us that, Adam. Okay, who's next? God, I want you. Ragnell. Oh shit, that's his like mystical weapon. Yeah. Oh wait, she can. She can do something. Yeah. You seem much more focused, more intense than usual. My sword, the Binding Blade was kept in this land for centuries. My memory of retrieving it must be granting me additional power. If a memory can grant power, then I'll give you a fight we'll both remember. Nice. Get it from there. Lord Roy? Is there not someone more, um, uh, adequate you should be fighting? Why are you talking nonsense, Alchrist? You are the Prince of Brodia, the land I was entrusted to. Who better could I face? Come, let our battle begin. Oh, nice. Can't hit a critical off him, huh? Well, this is a problem here.
This can only hit one, yeah. The Sage is going to be a problem. Him, not so much. He could be a problem. Hey, go ahead and throw that little spear. I won't forget this. Ooh, level up. Ten. More defense and resistance. I would fuck the shit out of her. I wanted to use, I still haven't even used the hurricane. Claimed victory. There you go, Slim Lance. He only has one hit point. I can see. Yeah! Oof. Yum. Alright, I'll take that. Thank you for entertaining my wish to fight. You're impressive. You would have won if I'd slipped up even once. I never want to have you as an enemy again. Please, you're embarrassing me. <sighs> What's wrong, Roy? You're staring. Yeah, because you're hot. It's just that you remind me of somebody I once knew. Her name was Edun. She was a demon dragon. And King Zephiel of Burn wished to use her to destroy humanity. A demon dragon. Like you, each of her eyes was of a different color. And she carried herself a bit like you, too. I never knew there was such a person. Did you battle this demon dragon? Well, I had a choice. Kill her and wipe out the dragons. Or save her, the enemy of mankind. Can you guess which I chose? Which was it? I'll tell you the whole tale once this war is over, and your world is at peace. He saved her. But you have to promise me you'll tell. I'm looking forward to the story. I promise. Until that day comes, I think we'll enjoy our time together. Okay, Rizoi. The whole thing was that the Binding Blade, the first of the two, Max Bond level unlocked, was Roy and Liliana and the children of Elliewood and Hector and everything. And then... The seventh one was the prequel to that, where you played as Hector, Lynn, and all that. So, in the... In Binding Blade, it was Zephiel... Who was... I don't want to say his love interest, because his love interest was kind of Liliana, who he grew up with. I love you. But... The Princess of Burn. Hi, baby. Her brother, or half-brother, brother from literally another mother. Hey, 
Hey, um... He was just disgusted with humanity due to the manner in which his father helped raise him and stuff. His father raised him with such reservation due to the fact that the queen was like an arranged marriage and he had some concubine on the side that he had his daughter with. And the queen was became a vindictive woman and everything. But... In the Binding Blade, Zephiel tried to unleash a dark dragon on everybody. Hey! At least your shoes match now. God, I want you. Yes. Now again, I really want to get back into, I was trying to play Binding Blade because my friend Scott from Superplex Music, he bought a 2DS and he had it. And he was like, yeah, I can't even get past the second map. So I just, I was kind of playing it a little bit. I got through one map and that was it. But I'm hoping because Metroid Fusion, they have the 3DS and, well, 2DS and Game Boy Advance on the Switch. And I was hoping that they'd start releasing Fire Emblem games because it just doesn't make any, any sense to me. They did re-release the first one, the original first one, for a time for like five bucks with, with real professional English translations as opposed to like some, some modded fucking, Please. I love you, emulator that, you know, has some guy's version of, like, oh yeah, this is what they were saying, you know, they had like an actual professional translation, or official, I should say, translation, but they never released like three, which was a Super Famicom game, or, or well, they did release one, but they never released four Super Famicom games. Five. And you could say, well, you know, Super Famicom, but they released these, like, Japanese exclusives on it, so I don't understand. Time for... not that. Time for... Divine Paralyze! Yeah! Uh, yeah! Move in my hair back, yeep. Alright, so which ones have I done? Uh, 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 okay, so. Begin the chapter. Then after this, we're going headfirst into the main storyline. The Lonely Air. Who the fuck is this? Incredible. Another island among the clouds. I mean, I already learned who it was. They told me with the update. I can sense another bracelet near here. We're quite close now, I'm certain. Ah, oh, there it is. The bracelet of the Lonely Air. I hope the emblem inside is friendly. Well, time to find out. Heed our summons, emblem of heroes. Well, I guess that's Veronica. Who the hell are you? Are you from Heroes? Wait. I am Veronica, Imperial Princess of Embla. Name yourself. That has to be from like her Heroes or something. I've never heard of her before, or Embla. An honor. an honor. What a strange thing to say. I'm honored to speak with such a distinguished emblem. There's nothing strange about that. 
And it just so happens we need all the allies we can get. Would you consider joining us? Joining you? As your ally? You have it the wrong way around. It is you who would be joining the Emblean army. But very well. I accept. You may join the heroes I have summoned from other worlds. You can do that? Yes. Where I come from, that power belongs to one called the Summoner. When I became an emblem, I developed the same ability. Now I am gathering heroes from... Yeah, that's gotta be her. That I might bring the Kingdom of Asker to ruin. I've never heard of any Kingdom of Asker. Neither have I. You will make a fine pawn in my schemes. Now, hold on a second. There is no time for delay. I must make you my hero before the summoner can do the same. Prepare yourself for combat. The victor commands the vanquished. Wait! I don't want to fight! You don't have a choice. Let's begin. I bet you know I should actually watch Heroes because I've never played. I've tried to play it. I've downloaded it on my phone whenever I was born. And the thing always needs like a 5 gig update that never actually happens. Well, new selection. Oh! Skeleton crew, skeleton crew, and I don't think I have what I want. Um, fuck. Alright, hold on. Let's take a look. Uh, how am I getting over there? Alright, hold on. She has... What the hell? Hilotsklof. I, I don't even know how to She uses an axe and a tome. That, she's pretty scary. I fall worse. And all I have is them and the, I just have a... Okay, this is... Uh, I guess we're doing this tomorrow. I guess we're doing this tomorrow. I will see you then. I'm going to look this up because I'm pretty sure this is heroes. See you tomorrow.